Hello, I am Max from Test Drive Vlogs, and today we're going to have a look at this 1981 Datsun B210 SL. This currently has about 20,000 miles on it, and it's in perfect condition besides a few chrome pieces. Chrome door handle. As you can see, the interior is basically perfect. Close the door, put the window down, and we will go ahead, start it up. Just two metal keys going back here. This is a five speed manual transmission. It's got that classic Nissan ding dong chime. It fires right up. As you can tell, the interior is very 80s with the tan door handle, windows, rear defrost over here. You can just turn on by doing that. Hood release down here. You got your headlights on the stock here. Gauges, fuel gauge, temperature, speedometer that only goes up to 85. As you can see, 20,266 miles on it has a tachometer as well as an analog clock over to the right. Horns on the side of the steering wheel which is a nice three spoke design with a Datsun emblem in the middle. Wipers over here. Radio which does work. Tune uh, presets down here. You can set your volume and your tone I believe the balance is on this one. Common control down here. You can tell. Different zones. Temperature. As well as fan speed. Cigarette lighter down here. Ashtray. Little cubby hole down there. As I said, this is a five speed manual. So you could first, second, third, fourth, fifth, and then all the way over. Down is reverse. A little bit of change storage on there. Emergency brake. Mirror is all manual, of course. No mirror on this side. So, let's go ahead, open the door, turn the radio off, and we shall turn the headlights right there, as well as the hazards. And let's go ahead and check out the outside. As you can tell, this car is very 80s designed with the square headlights up front, chrome front bumper, with the stripes on the hood. These are, I believe, 13 inch steel wheels. Yes, they are 13 inch, 175 wide. You tell the graphics go all the way down the side, along with the trim piece. Black mirrors. These side windows do open from the inside, but they just kind of pop open. It's more of a hatchback than a coupe, even though it's called the fastback coupe. That's in 210. See the chrome is kind of rubbing off on some of these uh, pieces, which I believe it, it also is a little bit on here, but something too big. That's really the only imperfections with the car. Rear windshield wiper, the sloping rear window. Chrome rear bumper, same as the front. See this is the SL package.
This is when Datsun, they were just about to give up the Datsun name, so they ended up putting by Nissan on all the Datsun badges. Everything works, all the lights work. It's pretty crazy. This car's like a time capsule. Fuel cap. A little bit of the chrome rubbing off. So go ahead and pop the hood. Under the hood is a 1.4 liter four cylinder. Runs like it's brand new. Go ahead and shut that up. And we'll go ahead and shut it off. Let's check out the passenger side. As you can see, the door, or the door panels are still absolutely perfect. Let's go ahead and have a seat. The car really is a time capsule of Datsun back in the 80s. Let's have a mirror on this side. And go ahead, flip the seat forward. There we go. A little bit of issues there. Let's have a nice back seat. Doesn't look like it's ever been used. Let's go and open the hatch. Let's put the key in, turn it, it pops open. Just pull it open. Again, everything is basically perfect back here. It does have a privacy protector, which you can flip back if you have something bigger that you need to put in there. All the carpet back here is absolutely perfect. Decent amount of space. You can probably take this out so you have, oh yeah, look at that. If you need more space. Go ahead and shut this. Anyways, thank you guys very much for watching this video on the 1981 Datsun B210 SL. Be sure to check out all of Moto, Moto Exotica's info in the description below. And I'm out of here. See ya! Go ahead, flip the seat forward. If I can, oh, there we go. You have to push it the other way. There we go.